part of Bigger's Thank a Greenkeeper Day, we are here today at Beeston Fields Golf Course, where I'm going to spend the day with head greenkeeper Steve and find out what it takes to be a greenkeeper and also ask him what he loves about being one. So I understand that you actually go through a lot of training and a lot of um, qualifications to actually become a greenkeeper. So tell me about that. Um, th yeah, there's lots of options. Uh, you can either go to uni or college and do it that way. Uh, for me, uh, I like to work. So I started off with um, just a local golf course at the age of 16. Oh, wow. Yeah, so uh, I started really young. Started off just a level two MVQ. So I, I did that through Myasco College. We did identification of grasses, trees. Um, then after that, I progressed and I wanted to progress even further. So I stepped up my tier of golf course and I stepped up to my level three MVQ. So I did a level three MVQ with my spraying. So okay. you have to do your spraying tests to be legal to spray chemicals, uh, fertilizers. Um, and then from there I, I did chainsawing. So I've got my chainsawing course so I can cross cut, maintain and fell chain, uh, trees. So I can look at all these trees yeah. and, and then I have to, I can assess them for damage. Um, if they've got any fungal spores in there, if they're leaning, if they're fragmenting, you know. So you have to be able to know what you're talking about with that. So you can identify all of the pieces of these trees right here? Yeah. Thanks to your yeah, qualifications. Yeah, yeah. Right. You have to, sometimes you have to refer back to books because you yeah, don't do yeah, it every course. day. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, you, you have to, that's just trees. Yeah. And then you look at your other tasks, like just maintaining equipment. You've got a your basics mechanics, you've got to change oil, you've got to put the machine on cut, you've got, you, so you have to understand wow. a bit about mechanics, a bit about engineering. Yeah. I feel I can never get bored of a job yeah. that can throw up any different challenge in one day. Underneath this golf course, yeah. we have pipe work that yeah. water the greens, that water the teeth. So we have to maintain the pipe work, we have to maintain the water pressure. So you're looking about pumps, you're looking about plumbing, stuff. plumbing yeah. fixing, wow. it's, it's a massive variety. And, it's, and your training is ongoing as well. It's not just, you know, you do your MVQs or you go to uni and then that's it, you're qualified. You're, you're constantly kind of refreshing as well. Yeah, constantly. And, and so through Bigger, we do regular uh, either Zoom meetings or we do get togethers where we're talking about new products coming out or we're getting together and retraining on certain aspects of the golf course or you know just because you have to refresh yourself constantly mm -hmm. every single winter we will go through every bit of kit as staff yeah we'll refresh ourselves through the health and safety of that machine on um, the maintenance of that machine and, and that has to be done every year so you have to understand what you are using there's there's nothing on a golf course that we don't touch we have to maintain wildlife, we have to maintain the putting surface, we have to maintain the watering system, we have to maintain the machinery that looks after all that area. We have to then do our planning, our, our focus for what we're going to achieve and what we're aiming to be. You know, it's, it's very um, budgeting, you know, we have to budget right, we have to um, look at the weather. I don't know a greenkeeper that doesn't check his phone to see what the weather's doing every day. Mm. You know, we're always like, what, what is the weather going to happen? Because that, that puts an impact on what we can do. Absolutely. So on a, on a day like today, it's quite still, so we could yeah. spray. Yeah. But if it's windy or, or if it's raining, we not, might not be able to spray. It's, um, yeah, it's nice, it's nice. I love it. 